Queen's Gambit declined, Yanofsky variation. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed Black in that one. The opening was balanced. White overpowered Black in the middle game. In the English opening, White plays c4 to take control of the d5 square without sacrificing a central piece. This is a more patient opening. The pawn push on d5 is ready with e6, and the bishop on the dark squares can advance. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. This makes winning a pawn a possibility. The bishop is prepared to grow into a functional square. It is a fair deal after all captures. Backs off. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is the last book move. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. This threatens to win a pawn. It is good. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. This prevents the opponent from being able to win a pawn. It is good. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. That's good. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. That's good. This poses a threat to a bishop who is confined. It is ideal. The opposing bishop gets kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is ideal. This moves the bishop to safety. This threatens to attack a trapped bishop. It is best. This may succeed in winning a bishop. It is ideal. This threatens to attack a trapped bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This gains time by putting a queen in danger and getting it to flee. It is quite good. This prevents an attack on a queen who may have been taken prisoner. It is ideal. By growing a queen from its beginning square, this activates the queen. It is ideal. A pawn can now effectively protect another piece because of this. It is ideal. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. That's good. This disregards a superior strategy for defending a piece that was being attacked. It is incorrect. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is ideal. This poses a threat to an outpost manned by a knight. It is incorrect. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This misses a chance to win back a piece. It is incorrect. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is ideal. By pinning a pawn, this increases pressure. It is ideal. This enables the adversary to make a passed pawn. It is incorrect. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is quite good. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. A rook enters the action after developing outside of its starting square as a result. It is ideal. When the queen retreats, this attack wins a tempo. It is ideal. The queen is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. This defends the pawn that was attacked. It is ideal. When a rook retreats, this attack wins a tempo. It is ideal. The rook is now in a safe position. That's good. By posing a threat to a queen and compelling it to flee, this wins a tempo. It is quite good. The queen is therefore moved to safety. It is quite good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This gives the adversary the opportunity to promote a passed pawn. It is incorrect. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. It is best. 
sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed Black in that one. The opening was balanced. White overpowered Black in the middle game.